So Mr. Rhett's going to be getting uh, NG tube. We're going to put it to low intermittent suction because he's got a distended abdomen. And we're using a 14 French. I'm going to measure it first. Okay. I'm going to measure from his tip of his nose around his ear. Okay. And then back down to his belly button. Then okay. we are going to use some lube. We're going to have a catheter tip syringe to check placement when you with auscultation with a stethoscope. Okay. I'm going to get my tape ready to tape it to his nose. Rip. So what's the, do you have any tricks as far as making sure it's going to go Well, in? if you have a more conscious patient, you can have them swallow. Okay. And uh, with this young man, we're just going to have to push it fast. Okay. So it went in real easy. Mm-hmm. And he's coughing it up. It's curling up in the back of his throat. Okay, so that's one of the risks. Mm -hmm. He is swallowing. He's thinking swallowing. Mm -hmm. Hey, Rhett. It's okay. Swallow for me. All right. All right, I'm going to check placement. Okay, so we got secretions coming back. Mm -hmm. secretions. You ever do like lidocaine, uh, Afrin no spray, or anything like that? The, um, the, 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 in the pediatric population, normally not. Maybe in the adult population or an older child. Okay. I think speed is getting it in quickly. Okay. 